Hey viewers, Colton Tackett on Sonic Boom Fan 101 here. Welcome back to my walkthrough of my Dale Dimension 4600. This is part two. And um, last time something went wrong. I couldn't even get the sound working. So yeah, I restarted the computer. So we're gonna see if the sound works this time. So, all right, oh, oops. Sorry about that, something's wrong here, okay. okay. Here we go. Oh, I forgot, I need to do this. Okay, this seems a little slow. Something may be wrong with it. All right, give me a minute. Okay, I think I typed in the password. So let's see if it signs me in. I hope it does. Wait, did I just click enter? I think I did. I just clicked enter. Why isn't it signing me in? Viewers, I don't know what the heck is happening, but just give it some time for it to load. I, this computer is pretty old and all that. I don't know if the sound's going to be working on the computer anymore. Like, maybe the sound card's broken. Maybe that's the problem. Okay, see, see uh, this, I know that this computer is pretty old and all that. I mean, I turned on the speakers, but I don't, I don't know if I hear any sound. You know what? Give it some time. I, I hope it logs me in. So, yeah, I got logged back in, and I, I just had to, like, do something, but, um... I had to test the sound, but unfortunately, oh, get out of here. Oh. Why is there a bug in here? Get out. Anyway, as I was saying, uh, I tried to test the sound, but it probably doesn't work, probably. Maybe because the speakers are broken, and we probably might need new speakers. I mean, they're already turned on. Why can't I hear any sound? Yeah, it's definitely because the speakers are old and we need new ones. That's probably the reason, so. Uh. Alright, so. We're not gonna go into the XP tour. Wait, this computer has like 74 gigabytes. 74.4 gigabytes. Look at that. Look at that. See it? The free space there is left there is like 58.7. Look at that. So you see that that that's a that's a I mean that does that does not much space. So yeah, um I know we're not going into the Windows meet we're not going into the Windows XP tour cuz there probably might be something wrong. So yeah, but we're going to go into some programs that I have that I've been using ever since when I was younger. Windows Media Player. There it is right here. See that? So, um, we're going to go from... Uh, yeah, so we start on the music thing. Uh, let's see. We go for each of these one by one. So, we have a non. We have, like, the... Pinocchio narration. Yeah, this is Pinocchio. And uh, this one is Beatrix Potter. Uh, Peter Rabbit, Once Upon a Time Classics, and songs about friends. I think that's what it says. Okay, and there's Bubble Guppies, and there's Caillou, uh, Candyland, there's Canyon, so there's Mansion on the Mountain, that's Car Carnival, mini Carnival Games Mini Golf. I mean, those are the things I eventually had. I recorded this myself. There's Charlie and Lola. Uh, and there's Chuck Profit. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, if you look at the album art, it kind of looks crappy. You see, that's probably from the secondhand jive thing. Anyway, uh, this has What Makes the Monkey Dance. Sorry if there's like two copies. For, and there's Cordero. This is Vamos Nanas. I, I still don't understand. How there's like a uh, freaking like two copies, uh, and there's David Byrne like humans do. Oh, and there there's this right here. There's Disney right here. There's Children's Favorites Volume One, 
And there's a, the other the other one here. That's the one I eventually have, but I don't really have the disc anymore. And this is Playoffs Disney Imagine and Learn with Music from 2005. I used to have a copy of this, but I think I probably lost it. So maybe I should get these songs onto a freaking thumb drive and then probably move them to a computer so that way I could, I could listen to them again. Anyway, we have Drive By Truckers, My Sweet Anna. Once again, I don't know why there's like two copies and there's Elroy Law. This is weird. Uh, okay, Flatlanders, Julia, Imperial Teen, Sugar, and this. I can't even understand it. John D. Graham. This one moment. But there's like three copies. There's The Lunch of the Pink Foot. Mm, Windows, Welcome Music from Microsoft. There's a Mitch Miller thing, but that's not actually Mitch Miller. This is actually Ken Sheldon, so they had to get that right. But yeah, there's a, there, this is actually the Scholastic Luring songs for following directions. And we have Music Match, which has Get More with Jukebox Plus. We have Highway Blues for News Stories, which is sample music. And we have a Raggedy Ann and Andy right here. This is a classic children's songs that's probably all we have here and then let's see there's rich uh, this is messed up uh, this is made up we have secondhand jive yeah this is definitely right san francisco this is sesame street but um i accidentally like did something about the second track this was supposed to be afka defi but i accidentally changed it to ain't we got fun <laughs> i don't know why i did that okay but yeah there's also hot 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 dance songs anyway here's what there's all we also have let's see what this uh slobber bone and then uh, for this one we have let's see uh christmas songs this th that's ready set sing NASCAR Fun 2004. I don't know. Let's see. Uh, it's Peter Rabbit musical favorites. But this is. Vic Chestnut and Fru. Yeah. Yeah. People kind of miss Vic, Vic Chestnut because he's already dead. He, he died in December 2009. Like, Christmas of 2009. So we kind of miss him a lot. Rest in peace. And there's like whatever these are, like right here. These are just made up. I don't know why I made that. Uh, maybe I should like uh, game at beers. So yeah, I tried to play a music file, but it said that there was an error. It windows me a player cannot play the file because it cannot support the codec that was used to compress the file. Anyway, we have some stuff that we have. This this ha these are some files I took a picture of. This is something I just did in this one here. Uh, there's a lot of pictures I took. Wait, not well, no, not really, because um, oh, th this one right here, you see that right here. Let me zoom in a little bit. This is uh, Blues Clues, Classic Clues on VHS. I have that one, especially Barney's Read with Me, Dance with Me. There's lots of stuff here too. Oh, Sonic the Hedgehog 2. I, I remember playing that. Oh, and Sonic Spinball. I think this... There's a Peanuts VHS called Lucy Must Be Traded Charlie Brown. I think that's what you call it. Oh, there's the JJ the Jet Plane DVD. I have that one. And then, all right, I see BJ from Barney and Friends. Alright. I'm just gonna go for all these oh the sleep book i think i remember about this book but yeah i think this is probably the book i was talking about i think i remembered reading that because that's probably what i've been reading before i think my hands are getting pretty tired i probably i might have to set the tablet down okay something may be wrong here oh, let's take a look at this that's Rolly Poly Oli, and we also have the JJ the Jet Plane thing. And there we have these sample things, and we also have these, whatever these are. And I think that's all we have there. And also, we have videos. 
And I think these are probably like, uh, well, probably from, don't know where these were from, but I remember watching these. Uh, oh, especially, oh, especially this one. You see that right here? That That's the one I remembered watching right there. That's the, that's the best one. But I don't know if the video is going to play, so I'm going to try playing it. Uh, I might have to move this video to, uh, well, let's just say a freaking uh, thumb drive. So, yeah, it really explains it. Oh, uh-oh. Windows Media Player has a, encountered a problem and needs to close. We are sorry for the inconvenience. Oh, are you serious? Maybe that's why this computer might not be doing good today. This is an old computer. Yeah, yours. I'll probably have to do something. I'll have to get a thumb drive probably. Give me a minute. Okay, I'm back, and yeah, I got a thumb drive right here. Here it is, right here. See it? Anyway, uh, I'm gonna put this, I'm gonna connect this thumb drive into the computer so that way I can put some old files into this. For example, some videos. Alright, I connected it. Alright, there, found new hardware. Oh, oh my goodness. I think maybe it hasn't been used on this computer yet. Maybe I could put some videos onto this. So maybe if I look for some videos onto this, then probably maybe I'll be able to like maybe watch my old videos there. Uh, you know what? I'm I'm not gonna play them because they might not do good. So click on my documents. Wait. Okay, right here. Let's see that. I think this probably might be something I remembered. Oh, and there's the video right here. I believe it. Um, but I think we're gonna need to like uh, go. On, we're gonna have to open another window. Maybe I should move some files to this. Okay. So now I think I'm gonna copy the file to this. Uh, maybe I could copy the file to the thumb drive. All right, let me click copy. There we go. Now I'm gonna go to my thumb drive file thing, and I'm gonna I'm gonna right click on this, click paste. Oh, it works! It finally works! Wow! Oh my goodness! This is pretty old. Oh crap! This was an accident, dude. Okay. And I, I don't really think I'm going to use much of this. Like, but I'll have to do this before I end the video, so... Okay. Alright, so yeah, I'm getting some of my old files onto the... The thumb drive. So this is really cool. I'm very proud that I'm getting some old videos onto the... Oh. Even this one. I think I remember getting this one, like... Maybe I could copy this and put it into this file. Okay, there we go. Um, this is also an old file, just to let you know. Oops. Oh, and there's also another old file. It says DSCN. Uh, it's a different file. It works on QuickTime Movie, so... I'll have to convert that to an AVI file, unfortunately. But I'll still copy this one to my thumb drive, however. I'm copying it, seriously. Oh, come on. Alright, click paste. Come on. There we go. So yeah, I'm very happy I'm getting something really cool onto this computer. I mean, this computer is pretty old, but I'm very happy I got something. Oh. Oh, crap. Sorry about that. I, oh, all right, there we go. I'll I'll copy this one to my thumb drive as well. And God, we still trust that. That's what that was on that was on YouTube. So yeah, it's right here. This was known as President's Day Five. Oh, and there's also a wine opener. I don't know where this was downloaded, unfortunately. But it's still a good file. I mean, I remember getting this. I remember watching it, too. Oh, I can also copy this. 
the Yahoo commercial. This is my favorite one on this computer. This is probably an old file, unfortunately. I'm, I do not even understand how they would have this. I wonder if we have the Dell experience video. If we have it in there, then... Oh, oh wait. There, there's one video we forgot. So, I think probably maybe we'll copy this one. Okay, we'll copy this right here. So, oh, my, my finger's in the way. Sorry about that. Uh, I think I'll have to set this down a minute. So I can rest my hands. Alright, click paste. It seems to be working so far. I'm very happy that this works. I'm getting, like, old videos to my thumb drive. Look at that. Awesome. Alright, now I'm gonna copy... Oh, there, there's the there's the sample Dell video right here that we use for the Dell computer. Oh, oh crap. Sorry about that. This was an accident. Okay, come on, come on. Alright, paste that. Right, there we go. There, see that? Nothing to it. Now we have another video onto this. I don't know how... how. Okay. I think this might be fine anyway. So yeah, there, there's some of my old... Vi there, there, some of the videos that were old and I put them onto the flash drive... Uh, thumb drive, that is. So... Still hoping that maybe I could get myself some new speakers, or maybe we might have to fix the sound card. But it's still really good that we have something awesome here for a change. So anyway, we're going to be done for now. So we're going to have to shut this down. <clears throat> we get that. We already get that the new pro program's installed, even though this computer is outdated. I mean, I know that this is, like, out of support, but at least it still works, and I could still use my account on there. I think we're going to turn off the computer now, because I feel like I have to use, I have to turn it off, so. But, yeah, I, that, that, I'm going to end part two of this, so this is the end, that's the end of part two of uh, my Watt Fruit for the Dell Dimension 4600 running Windows XP. So, yeah. What we're also going to do, like... On part three, I'll be able to ch change my desktop background again. I mean, maybe I can like move some of my old picture, some of my Sonic pictures to this computer. Maybe one or two, probably, and then I could like switch the background. Then maybe I could have a Sonic picture on the background. Anyway, we're gonna shut this computer down. And sorry about how this is happening to the computer. Like, it's a little blurry. Look at that. Look. But at least it's shutting down now, and it's so... Yeah, I kind of miss this computer a lot. Okay, it's shutting down now. There we go. Alright, it's shutting down now. Alright, now we'll be... That'll be it for part three. That'll be it for part two of my walkthrough for the Dell Dimension 4600 running Windows XP Home Edition. And yeah, I know this is an old computer, but it still works. I know that the sound doesn't work, but it's still a good computer anyway. And that'll be it. This is Colton Tackett on Sonic Boom Fan 101 signing off. Oh, oh crap. Forgot about the music. Sorry. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.